What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Hunter Alva J, and I'm back with another YouTube video. Today, we're going to be reacting to Emmanuel Henderson. Before we get into the video, make sure you guys subscribe, like, comment. It'll help your boy out. Uh, we've been gaining some subscribers, so I'm really grateful for that. Also, been um, the the Corey, I mean, not Corey, the Connor video been blowing up, and also the Gentry Williams video been blowing up. So, let's keep it coming, man. Keep the support coming. It's positive energy, you feel me? That's what I'm about. But, um, yeah, Emmanuel Henderson hit a number one rated running back in the class. I actually thought Raleigh Brown was. Well, I think I knew Raleigh was second, but I already watched Raleigh Brown. He was pretty good. He was 5'8". He was fast. He just was an all-around running back. He he go to modern day. But we're going to see if Emmanuel Henderson better. I'm going to be the judge of that. But let's get into this video. Let's see some. Oh. I already cut back. Oh, get oh, you sit down. I ain't gonna lie, he already showing me some. That was crazy. That was crazy. Uh, he's he's he looked way bigger than Raleigh. He looked faster than Raleigh. I'm not even gonna lie. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. Don't tell me Bama got another one. You know we already know Bama good at recruiting running backs. When the last time they had a bad running back. <laughs> oh, he gone. Shh, they so deep at running back, bro. Oh my god, he oh, he's just fast, bro. He's too fast. He too fast, bro. He too fast. Up, oh, he just cutting back. Oh my god. Oh my. Oh my. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, I ain't been this hype about a running back since um since Travion Henderson I did last year. Let me see that again. Travion Henderson was doing this in his highlight video last year. Oh, oh, cutback. Oh, my goodness. I called Travion Henderson the cutback king. That's what I had called him. Sheesh, this dude looked tough. I'm not going to lie. He just so fast, bro. He just outrunning everybody. But you also have to take into account that Riley playing against the best competition in the nation. He goes to one of the top schools in the nation, so... You already got to take that into account. But this dude, he handling business. Get out of there. Oh, my. Dude just... <laughs> bro, he big. He, first of all, he's big. Then he's fast. He got moves, too. So, I ain't gonna lie. He the total package. If he can catch the football, perfect running back. Then he going to Bama, too. So, that's tough. That's tough. We're going to have to deal with this dude for a few years if he even goes to Bama and even stays there. <laughs> bro, how do you miss that tackle? Bro, I know it just got to be frustrating just to play him, bro. Oh, my God, if he scores this. Oh, my, bro. Oh, just in a phone boot. You can't tackle him, man. Oh, just just jump over you. I'm not gonna lie. I'm I, if I had to pick out of him and Raleigh, I'm taking him. But I'm I, but I'm not saying Raleigh, I'm not saying it's a big gap because Raleigh playing against the best competition. I don't know what this competition is, but if I had to pick one, like just off the style, like I was saying, if I had to pick one off the style, I'm picking Emmanuel. I'm not gonna lie. He just he just got me more excited than Raleigh had me. You know. But that, that's the same thing that happened with Dante. I mean, I keep saying Dante. I mean, Damani Jackson. The same thing happened with him. He um he go to modern day as well. He the cornerback. And he just didn't really get me as exciting as these other players. But it's also, but I also got to like know that it's because of the competition. They playing against modern day, playing against the best competition. They playing against people like random people in high school they could be they could be the best player on the field they could be the only player on the field they got an offer you see what I'm saying like that's the difference but it could be that but just off style I'm like Emmanuel Henderson more this dude he, he's he's already probably one of my favorite players in this whole class with Travis Hunter um CJ Hicks um Gentry Williams they like my favorite players so far that I've watched so far they um make me the most excited about them. Also, Connor, I can't forget about the goat, Connor. But yeah, y'all let me know in the comment section who y'all think better, him or Emmanuel. I mean, not him or Emmanuel, Emmanuel um or um Riley. Y'all let me know who y'all take. 
I know who I'm taking. I'm taking him. So, yeah. But that's going to be it for the video. I'm going to catch y'all.